myself Tell him he can't start leaving now He said this is your mix, your love is on Why haven't you called? Oh shit, what the fuck you doing in my yard, baby? I waited by the phone for hours. Whoa, you just dropped me off an hour ago. It's only been an hour for real. I wonder what's wrong with you. I bet it's now that I think about it, I did act prematurely. This motherfucker crazy in a room temperature ice. It's just a misunderstanding. I'm gonna go home and wait a little bit longer for you to call. If you don't call me in about I guess like 45 more minutes, then I'll come back. No, 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 no. Don't come back. Just go home. Stay there. Stay the fuck there. Okay, so you are about to call me. Okay, that's good. Cause oh, I, no. What you mean? I, I mean, I, I call you a therapist. Wait, what, what you talking about? You need fucking I, help, bro. You're crazy. You're insane. I don't have time for the crazy shit. Bitch, I ain't fucking crazy. You're crazy if you think bro, I'm crazy. you're not a complete, fully grounded ass man in my yard dressed like a bat right now? I don't see your point. You don't see my, motherfucker, you're crazy as a carrot at a bitch slap convention. You're crazier than bananas at a whorehouse. Bro, you need several hugs, two handshakes, and a high five. You're crazier than Howie Mandel comb shopping in the Brazilian jungle, then swimming in the Amazon with Prince Charles with nothing but a condom. I don't need this shit. I'm not fucking crazy. How you gonna say that after I gave you that long ass description on how you crazy? I wasn't listening to most of that bullshit. And it's King Charles now. Batman, you're fucking stupid. The queen has to be dead for him to be called King Charles. What? She's been dead for a week, bitch. <laughs> This is a game of balls. So none of y'all should even be here. That is sexist. Sexist? Let me tell you little heifers, hoes, and bitches something real quick. All that Generation Z shit, you can leave at the goddamn door. Because everything you think is wrong, I think is right. I was born in the 50s. Do you know what that means? Um, you old as fuck? I mean, you ain't even all boomer. You a tumor. You too old. You need to be a boomer. Oh! Oh my god! Oh, bitch, I know you're in the house. Someone call me. Oh my god, I can smell my brain. Oh my god, I can smell my brain. Oh, don't run from it, bitch. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, the hell? Oh, thank God you're awake. Iggy is here, you bitch. What? No. Look, where, where am I? You're waking up from a four-day coma. Oh my god, what, what happened? What's no, that? I, I don't know. Somebody said you got hit by a car or something. That's crazy. But hey, here's a cat. Hit by a car? Hey, where, where is Alvin? Alvin? Alvin who? Alvin and the chipmunks? No, no, my husband! Oh, oh, your husband. Yeah, the, the guy that was with you when you got hit by the car. Oh, he, he's dead. He's dead as fuck. What, what? Yeah, so what had happened was, the car hit both of you, but he got the worst of it. Oh, my God! Those were actually his last words. He didn't get to, to the D on God, though. He's kind of said, oh, my God! And then he exploded kind of on contact with, like a, like a water balloon filled with fucking chili. I mean... What? Blood and intestines and in, in trails were everywhere. It was de fucking disgusting and it smelled like old seafood left in the sun. I, I, it was a good thing you were unconscious because you didn't want to see that. But I do have pictures. Who in the fuck are you? Oh, my sincere apologies. How rude of me. I'm Cammy. And why the fuck are you here? Well, you, I, I kind of need your insurance information. My insurance? Oh, you work for the hospital. That's what Hospital? No, no, not your health insurance. I, I need your uh, homeowners or car insurance. Car? Huh? What? Why? What? Is it oh, well, funny story. I'm kind of Drive up the vehicle that put you in a coma and caused your husband to explode. What? Yeah, I know it's kind of an awkward first meeting or uh, uh, whatnot. But, you know, I, I gotta get my car fixed because I gotta go back and forth to work, you know, and <laughs> I don't have the funds to pay for it out of pocket. But I did bring you this cat. Wow. This cat I found. Get the fuck away from me, nurse! Oh my god, this, there's no need to be rude. Did you kill my husband and put me in a coma? Wait a damn minute. First of all, I didn't kill your husband. My car did. That is the same thing, sis. Second of all, do you want this damn cat? What I want is to strangle you to death with my bare hands! Well, I'm sorry you can't do that, because you don't have hands anymore. What? Or arms, or legs, or feet. You lost them in the accident. <laughs> Just take this fucking cat and give me a policy on it, please. Oh, oh, next time, don't cross the street holding hands with your husband. Cross one at a time. Like, if you both hold hands, both of you are going to get fucking hit. It's fucking stupid. And your husband's name is stupid as well. Fuck names yourself after a chip.